<laughs> Let's talk about our couples, guys. So I think the biggest thing from last night was, for me, was Toby. Because I really mm. liked Kaz and Toby. They were one of my favourites. And I feel like they were really genuine. But everyone said that everyone that's come on on this show has said that they felt like Toby was going to be swayed. And I didn't think it took a lot for him to get swayed. No, well, it didn't take a lot at all, did it? I mean, uh, just a little bit of interest from another girl and that's it. And exactly. suddenly, that, and it, it was the same as what we we're saying about Aaron, you know, those little excuses that come about um, that they're sort of storing up to sort of use them eventually. He started doing that. I'm, I'm gutted. Are you surprised? Because I feel like it's literally come out of nowhere. Honestly, totally shocked. Again, I Yay. really liked... I was proper backing Kaz and Toby. I thought they were great. Um, I, I heard your podcast the other day with Nick Grimshaw and, and you were saying how, like, Kemi, you were saying how, like, you felt it was quite immature how he was talking. Mm. And I was, I, was, I was hearing it. Like, I'm, I'm there and I'm sitting there thinking, no, you're totally right. But he just came yeah. into someone else last night. He just turned into someone else. It's like he just plucked up the courage to be able to say stuff. Do we think it's going to last? The, is it going to go the length of the, the series? I mean, is this another thing. Maura situation? Because she's reminding me a lot of Maura and that she's I'll a woman who knows thing, her Aaron. mind. Sorry to cut you short. No, but tell me. Chloe, Chloe and Toby will not work. No? No way. Is she way not our like, new years. series like Maura? No. no. Toby needs a girl to kind of like just stick it on him because he hasn't really got that I don't feel like he's got that thing in him where he'll kind of put it on him but I just think him and Chloe no way in my opinion I don't I know I just yeah. feel like she only likes Toby because there's no other options at the moment when another guy walks in I personally think she will go for them but did this come yeah. from the challenge the other day Sunny I'm asking you because they had that challenge the other day and they're like who if you weren't with your couple who would you stick it on and everyone and said Chloe them. All of them said Chloe. And she, this is where it's all started from. So I do think there's a certain like element of like, that was the trigger. That was the kind of like catalyst, this whole event. But I get that Kaz was saying that uh, Chloe was a bit sneaky. But I also think like it is Love Island and like crack on if there is an opportunity there. But I do feel so bad for Kaz because I think she thought her and um, Toby would go the distance. Yeah, I think the worst thing about it as well is we're sitting at home watching it and we're we're seeing what she isn't and you're just thinking oh she doesn't even know this yet like she doesn't fully know what's going on until they're obviously having the conversations and that's that's the part where I feel bad for her you know like if she's had having conversation with Toby being honest and open about you know their their relationship together and stuff you sort of think okay fair enough but it was almost like the first she heard of it and it was a bit like oh well where's this come from Mm, definitely yeah I agree look I think she could have told Kaz a bit better because I felt like at points it was happening right in front of Kaz. Like she was just kind of watching it unravel. But then that could be Toby's fault as well. But I have to say one thing. She handled it unbelievable. Unbelievable, yes. Kaz. I also it. think Toby's a massive feel because he said he isn't massively, um, he doesn't have a massive sexual attraction to Kaz. I'm sorry, what? Have you seen her? Did we all see her in that challenge? She was like the most like incredible. Like, she won it, obviously. And also just unbelievably good looking I know Chloe is as well but like come on how can you not be sexually attracted to Kaz I am No, you both she are is, I know it she is amazing I think I think that Chloe's made it easier for him and Kaz hasn't and I think he, in his head he's probably thinking well this is an easy option and I want this right now mm. where Kaz was playing the long game which would probably work out better eventually well that yeah. all ends in a snog on the bloody terrace didn't it it will <laughs> 